Let's be honest, girl, is your brain ever fully awake? What's up, guys, and welcome back to more Song of Memories. Now, I'm going to preface this next recording session by saying I am recording this late at night. So, if you're wondering why I'm a bit more soft, why I'm going to be a bit more soft spoken in these next few episodes, just know it's because, yo, know, I'm trying to be considerate and not wake anyone up. I don't know what you're thinking, dude, why don't you just wait and record in the day? Well, right now, I'm just, I, I can't right now, but I do need to record, so here I am. It's 11 o'clock at night, and I'm about to record for 8 hours. <laughs> That's right. A an activity commonly referred to by the youth as an all-nighter. <laughs> now, it has been several years since I've even considered pulling one of these all-nighters. However, I'm going to do it. <laughs> because fuck you, I can do that if I so want to. But regardless... Also, <laughs> you may hear me sipping on my soda from time to time because I need sugar and caffeine to fucking keep me awake. And of course, a train go chooses to fucking go by my house now, right after I just start the recording session. How rude. Yeah, thanks for that, asshole. But regardless. Okay. But anyway, last time, where we left off, uh-huh. Yuno had escaped from the academy because Rotom is hunting her down because her dad is an all-powerful diplomat, blah blah blah. Um, she ran to our house, we took her in, and um, we boned. As you can tell by the naked um, Yuno laying in my bed the next morning. <sighs> When I open my eyes, I'm startled to see Yuno in bed next to me. I know it's gotta be pretty dope, right? What should I do? Things have gotten kind of awkward because we, last night, we boned. I guess it's just something y'all gonna have to get used to, huh? Wink wink. So, so that. Aww. God, I love Yuno. She's fucking great. How can you not love Yuno? Yuno was. So that. Hat's the best feeling in the world. Aww. Aww. Oh, she kissed my cheek. That's kinda hard when you have very large areas of infection. Yeah. Girl, you fucking gorgeous. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. <laughs> well, I wasn't. Girl, you fucking gorgeous. I'll repeat it as many times if I uh, that as many times as I need to. All right, I'll fucking repeat it until the day I fucking die. Girl, you fucking gorgeous. Hell yeah. My turn this time. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I'm smiling. God damn it, it's always these moments. There's always the nice moments where I'm smiling so big and that's when everything goes to shit. It happened with Satsuki's route too. After, you know, they slept together and they're having their little fucking next morning conversation. I'm smiling big as shit because I'm, I'm feeling the fucking good vibes and then everything goes to shit. There really wasn't anything like that with Cannon's route. Well, that's because, well, for one, there wasn't any, uh, you know, intercourse in Cannon's route, at least not that I observed anyway. So there was that, but then there was also the, there was never this, even, you know, intercourse aside, there was no, like, really nice moment where, like, 
they confessed their feelings for each other. That didn't happen until like the very end of the route. Like, so cannons was a bit different. Kind of turned me off in that point. So, well, that's the thing with cannons. Like, it just got kind of, excuse me, darker and darker as it went. Like, there was no, there, there were none of these lighthearted moments that really kind of like, yo, kind of brought your spirits up. And then when the ending comes along, it just smacks right down. Like, nah, it was just always kind of on a downhill spiral. Downhill spiral. You kept feeling worse and worse throughout all of cannons are out. However, with Satsuki's now, you knows, yo, you have this nice little moment. These nice little moments where you're just like, ah, everything's so wonderful. I mean, I don't want to even say the words what could possibly go wrong, but th they're kind of in the back of your head. Obviously, I know what could possibly go wrong. I've seen it go wrong twice now. And I have th th fucking this route and three more routes after it to see how many fucking ways it could possibly go wrong. <laughs> but it's like, ah, uh, that's the thing. Like, I just know. I just know. Well, for one, I know, yo, the worst is coming. It's it's right up next. Not only do I know it's coming, I know it's like right up next. But also, I know it's going to hit me like a ton of bricks because I'm just feeling so good in this moment. But I don't care. This moment is fucking nice. Man, I wish I could be happy first thing in the morning. I always just wake up and it's just... <laughs> doesn't matter if it's because of an alarm or I'm waking up naturally. It doesn't fucking matter. I never fucking wake up happy. Let's be honest, girl. Is your brain ever fully awake? Boom, got him. Is it because we fucked? Yeah, because we fucked. Maybe it's because we fucked. True. Has it been two weeks in game? Has it really? November 8th? No. No, November 8th. That's not two weeks. Was it? 27th. So before. Tw only, almost two weeks, yeah. Fuck. Alright. Yeah, I wonder why that is. I definitely don't know the exact answer to that, but um, yo, maybe we will find out later, huh? Wow, it's almost like there's something accelerating it. And it's probably going to accelerate it in Yuno as well now that she's with us. I wonder what it could possibly be. <laughs> she says with a smile on her face. What really scares me though is the final stage of a person who's infected. Maybe I should tell Yuno that if the virus progresses fully inside of her, that she'll turn into one of those Neo men. No, she might already know that. Satsuki might have found it out and told her. Yeah, she told me I'll turn into a big, gross, disgusting fucking monster. Also, I just want to say, <laughs> now that they're bringing that back up, yo, I've, I've, now that I've really had time to really edit through my footage now, because as of this recording, I'm still editing through uh, Cannon's footage. Uh, the footage on Cannon's route. But um, there's been ev there were mentions even in Cannon's route, the fucking last route we went through, that 
there was a possibility of men getting infected. There were men worried about getting infected, even though it was in Cannon's Route where it was first you know, introduced. And I think I already pointed this out in Cannon's Route, but this game keeps contradicting itself on that one fact. On that only females get infected. It's like, I believe it because we've seen no men get infected. But yeah, why are there men worried about getting infected if it's like common knowledge that females are the only ones who get infected? I don't know. I, I just... Ugh. I don't know. I feel like it, it, it's... I feel like it's a fact they're trying to, you know, introduce that they're not really sticking with. It's more there for, like, plot's sake. For me, like, oh, worry about the women because, you know, those are the only love interests. All your love interests are women, obviously. So, you know, you gotta worry about the women and what'll happen to them. You gotta be protective of them and whatnot. And you... I don't know. It's... Ugh. I don't know, the, the fact that they keep mentioning that bothers me because they just, they don't stick to it themselves. Like, if it were something they actually stuck to themselves, that, I mean, I guess they do stick to it, but the fact that they keep kind of jumping around with it, and like, there are different characters that kind of contradict that statement, it's, eh, I don't know, every time I see it, kind of just, mm, I don't like it. But that doesn't help the poor people who got left here. Yeah, no, she's dead. Well, then what do we do then, huh? What do you fucking suggest? Why you gotta bring the mood down like this? Like, what do you suggest? It's only a matter of time before they wind up here. What do you suggest then? Don't fucking bring up a problem if you don't have a fucking... Some idea of a solution, right? Oh, excuse me. Seriously. I just... Like, you're gonna start killing the mood, and then you're gonna bring up problems that you can't even begin to bring solutions to. Like, I get it, you have to make sure you're aware of it, but... But where else is she supposed to go? Like, I... Ugh. I mean, there's really nowhere we can send her where they won't find... Where they won't, you know, attempt looking. Just say it, ooh. No, oh wait, his name's not Uwu anymore. Just fucking say it, dude. Ouch, Yuno's gaze is hurting me. <laughs> you still haven't said something very important to me, homie. <laughs> Say it. She's right. I haven't. I just feel very silly saying it. Say it. Don't you fucking deny that girl those words. No, you fucking bitch ass. Say it. No. I mean, I, I mean, that is a fair trade. Do it again. <laughs> oh, I love you, no. Do what's wrong with telling you her you love her or giving her a smooch? Okay, okay. I, just need... <laughs> Jesus. I needed to advance the conversation. That was starting to fucking. Ugh. But like, dude, why would you not want to fuck it? I mean, look at that face. Why would you not want to tell that face that you love her? Why would you not want to kiss that face? It's a fucking adorable face. It's a gorgeous face. What is wrong with you, dude? I feel silly saying it. Why? If it's the way you feel, why would you feel silly saying it? And you know she feels the same way about you. Oh. Oh, this main character pisses me off. Oh. She's leaning in. Sheesh. Why ask for a kiss if you're just going to kiss me yourself? Oh, I'm here all... Shut up, Fuka. God damn it. Cock blocking without even being in the room. Rude. If you're well enough to yell at us, you're probably plenty healthy. <laughs> Oh, 
Wonder how much noise we made last night. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> like, I imagine it's both of theirs first times. They are high schoolers after all. And there's no indication as to the fact that either of them were ever in relationships prior. I doubt it was the quietest experience. That's probably why Fuka's a little upset too. Even though she's kind of the one who helped like push us together, but you know, she's like right next door, I've probably heard everything happening. It was just like, guys, can you just give it a break in the morning? I've been trying to sleep. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, well, you can't get infected, so stop being a bitch about it. First, it was Fuka and me taking care of Cannon. Then, just me taking care of Fuka and Cannon. Really, it's helpful to have the comparatively healthier Yuno to help out. Where did you get your clothes? I didn't expect she had time to pack when she fucking escaped from the infirmary. Maybe she did and I just didn't realize it. But I feel like she had she just bolted after Satsuki's call. Don't you fucking judge me, you little shit. Don't you give me that face. That fucking mm, face. Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the way your fucking lips are fucking curled like that. I don't like it. I don't fucking like it. No, let's not be nice. I'm ready to throw hands at that little shit. Come on, you little fuck. Bring it. Come on, you little turd. Let's fucking do this. Put him up, you little bitch. I'll fucking... Come on. Come on, let's do this. I'm gonna fuck you infected. I'll fucking knock your ass out. <laughs> Don't you ever fucking talk shit at me like that again. We haven't had this homie. <laughs> <laughs> this homie atmosphere and dance. <laughs> oh, I love it. And we owe it all to you now. You know, used to be so passive and meek. Now that she's acknowledged that she likes being praised, she's starting to really shine from the heart. What, did you not have faith in your own cooking? You know, I'm so good at that and I'm sure she hasn't really had the fucking best nutritional fucking food living up in the infirmary getting shit brought to her from her friends God damn it, I need to be quiet, fuck. <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh, that killed me. Oh, one more. I, I, God damn it. I'm already waiting for them to fucking react to it. <laughs> Their fucking faces. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I'm trying to be quiet, god damn it. <clears throat> mm, so, oh, <laughs> I fucking reread it. Oh my god. 
<laughs> fuck me. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, breathe. 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 Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Just Fuka's face. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I can't help it, it's just fucking cracking me up. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Okay. God damn it, I can't do it. Okay. For a second, the air freezes. No. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Oh, please tell me she's playing along and she's not oblivious to this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck me. <laughs> oh my god, I'm trying so hard not to be loud. I'm fucking burying my face in my shirt, covering my face with my hands, I'm trying everything, but this game is not making it easy. Oh god damn it, I love you, you know. Oh, you're fucking amazing. I'm gonna open my mouth and say, oh, and you're gonna stick your wiener in it. Oh my god. Oh my god, I was not ready for this. Oh my god, I was not ready for this. Oh, this is amazing. Bro, you started this. Yeah, you totally did do that. Oh, she's totally fucking playing along with it. <laughs> well, honestly, I expect both of you to die, so don't worry about it. What? You got something wrong with me sticking my wiener in her mouth? Well, you want me to stick my wiener in your mouth too? まあ、花嫁修行にもなるし、いいんじゃないかな。あ、そうだ。俺も教えてほしいんだけど。お兄ちゃんまで料理を覚えるの?いや、料理じゃなくてだな。えっと、風花って刑事物のドラマとかたま
ビビった。おな、おなゆがフリッターマン。帰ってくるなりへたりこんで、かっこ悪いな。そんなこと言ってもな、腰が抜けるくらい緊張するんだけど。お疲れ様。It really wasn't. That was very bad work. The fact that he was kind of like stuttering and everything, like, I, I, you know, well, I do bad. <laughs> What tips did Fuka teach you? How badly would you have handled that if you wouldn't have had fucking any help? Jesus Christ, man. Because you handled that very fucking poorly, in my opinion, but Jesus. <laughs> いつも2にもとにかく黙って余計なことを話さない。大体みんなおしゃべりでボロが出るんだよね。口はわざわいのもとっていうくらいだし。あとは、何を言うんだろう。何を言うんだろう。何を言うんだろう。何を言うんだろ